Hello, good evil and in between. Uh, it's Philosophy Friday. This week will probably be a longer one. I'm not just going to rip through it and ask a question. Because this relates to my whole Philosophy Friday uh, uh, questions I've been asking. I, I found out that probably why I'm asking these questions more is um, at a stage in my lifetime, which many could consider uh, a midlife crisis stage. Yes, believe it or not. Uh, I'm in my 40s, I'm actually 42, yeah, I'm gonna sound it, I'm gonna act like it, especially in my gameplays, I do uh, I do go off on one quite often, but that's what I'm like, a bit of a scatterbrain. Anyway, uh, I found out, well, I was sort of aware of it, but I never thought it maybe applied to me, but I've been feeling a little bit different in this sort of stage of my life than, say, I used to. Uh, I think they call it uh, an existential crisis sort of moment. And I believe that's kind of linked where I brought up this Philosophy Friday where I'm asking these kind of like deep sort of questions about reality, existence and that. Which I've always felt, but it seems like it's come on a lot stronger in the last few years, especially when I hit 40. Yes, life begins at 40. You start worrying about life more at 40, I think. Uh, I don't want to get too down and depressed about this because I don't feel I am as such. It's just that these questions about existence and life and mortality especially especially when you get older unfortunately when you get older you, you start you start feeling physically older for a start your mind might be still the same but you notice things ain't so great as you get older especially when you see other people start disappearing from your world and stuff I, I think it can get to you more than people ever let on because everyone's too busy just carrying on in their lives and that so how dare you question your life and that you should be happy you should be permanently happy and you'd never let anything bother you, never even think about anything else, just carry on what you're doing. But paint that happy smile across your face. I, I'm not down because I'm thinking about stuff like this. It's, uh, when you're a kid, you, you think you're a mortal, you, you might as well be a vampire, you are never going to die. Okay, some people lose people when they're very young, and that probably twists their perceptions and it wakes them up to reality that we are mortal. As I've, as I've grown older, it always seems to be really this sort of thing in the back of my mind that, hey, I've got this many years ahead of me, blah, blah, blah. Uh, my health isn't great, but I still hold on to hope that I'll, I'll live to a good old age and I will be happy with my time on Earth. But as I've reached this stage, oh, I told you this is going to be a longer Philosophy Friday. So I, I just want to share it. And sort of like the uh, the idea, the philosophy behind my questions. I was just, maybe I just found out I needed to share it. I've got people in my life, I've got people I love, and people that love me back, hopefully. And I'm happy, I'm happy with what I do, I'm happy with my interests in life, and it's all good. But you always have this kind of, I wouldn't say it's a darkness, it's always something in the back of my head that always feels like, I don't know, why do I overthink? It seems like I try to dig deeper than, I don't know, are we, are we not, are we meant to sort of exist on a superficial level? Never be self-aware of mortality? It's crazy. Correct me if I'm wrong. There was a quote from uh, Bob Dylan. He said, "You can be get busy living or get busy dying," which I think is quite appropriate. Yeah, I mean, like I said, I enjoy a lot of things in life. I, I, I love and hate things like everybody else, but I want to carry on in it. I don't want to end this this chapter. I don't want to end this movie of me. I want to carry on as long as possible, health permitting and all that. Yeah, why not? It's brilliant. It's great. It, no, some things are bad and that, and obviously I wish I could change stuff like that, but that's just, that is life. I, I don't know what I'm looking for, it's just seemed, I'm in an odd point where it's almost like I feel, you think, bloody hell, I'm at half time of, of a life cycle on average. And you, think, and you start almost counting the decades, and you think, God, is that how many there are? I'm not dwelling on what might have been and all that stuff, because it is what it is, I mean. Uh, you don't, I, don't, I don't look back with any sort of regret is such I mean life life rambles along the way it's meant to ramble along yeah I, I so existential crisis you, I don't know you're trying to ask these questions it's a bit like the philosophy questions I was all about I mean there is no real answer to it is there I'm not going to say it's mental or that's just a term I use but I think it's daft I, I try not to waste too much time on it but it's always there it's not about uh, financial gain or anything what I, what I may or may not have in my life or possessions and that that's not really that's not really the point what do you guys think? Have you got any insight into this? Uh, 
Yeah, tell me what you think. I am keeping it real, keeping it raw, and I'm keeping it very long. Cynical Chinchilla, Philosophy Friday. See you guys later.